Hello my YouTube friends. This is not a video about some of my tech, which I do have videos coming up. I know I've been off for a minute, I've been pretty busy. I did get some new stuff. This is something else. I have a Chevy Cobalt 2006. I remember a long time ago when I bought the car in 2006, the salesman showed me how to program the key. If I ever lose my keys and I lost my keys and I need to get a new one. So I got a new one today. It's pretty simple. I see a lot of video. I forgot because it's been so long. So I went on YouTube, of course, and they had a lot of the Chevy programs that takes the 30 minutes. This one doesn't for the Chevy Cobalt. I remember it being a lot quicker. So I'm going to make this a quick one for anybody who has a Chevy Cobalt. Basically, what you do is you take your factory key or any Mac key, like even the replacement key will do it for a new key. Once you program it, whatever key you program, you just take the car insert the key turn it to the on position and then turn it right back off take the key out take your replacement key stick it in turn it on and and i'm gonna show you what you look waiting for you see the um icon right there the one i'm turning back on again the lock security car one right there when that goes out with the replacement key, that means the key is programmed. So you just turn it off, take the key out, wait about five seconds, stick the key back in, and the car start right up. So you don't have to do the 30 seconds with the Chevy Cobalt like you do with, I see a lot of people doing with the other Chevys. This key, the program, the self-programming keys for the Chevy Cobos takes like less than five minutes. So I hope this video helps somebody. If y'all end up losing your Chevy key, you know, I went right to, um, which was pretty cool. I went to Home Depot. They got the key for like $39. But when they insert your key into the machine to see if they have the key or match it up, whatever, it takes a picture of the key itself when they stick it in the machine so you don't even have to give them the key back so y'all went paid for it came back he stuck it in there cut the key i say less than i'm gonna say less than 20 minutes with everything said and done i had my replacement key so there you go